member for London West. Uh, thank you, uh, Speaker. My question is to the Premier. Speaker, in the face of an unprecedented health and homelessness crisis, Londoners have rallied behind a transformational whole-of-community response to help those struggling with homelessness, mental health and addictions. With leadership from local agencies, hospitals, emergency services, police, businesses, developers and City Council, our community is united in making system-level change, and a generous donor family has galvanized $35 million in direct community funding. But, Speaker, London can't do it alone. Will the Premier commit today to funding the hubs and supportive housing units that are core to this first-of-its-kind local strategy? Associate Minister. Thank you, Mr. Speaker. And once again, we have been working with the stakeholders in London to understand the needs of the community. We've worked with them uh, with CMHA. There is a crisis hub which diverts individuals away from the hospitals and provides them with the kind of supports and services they need to effectively give them the treatment and the supports that they need. We understand in the continuum of care that there are different aspects, and we are making investments, whether it's withdrawal management, treatment beds, housing to support the individuals as they transition out. These are all aspects of the roadmap to wellness. They're all parts of the continuum of care, and they all par are part of the social determinants of health that go to the very underlying issue of addictions. So we are making those investments and building that continuum of care. Again, after neglect over 15 years by at the previous Response. government, it's very difficult to put all of these in place and ensure that they're all working together. But we are filling gaps. We are working with communities to, to, to stakeholders. To Thank you.